Welcome everyone to another video and in this video we are going to be featuring a trainer in rank 10 doing something that you know I would not highly advise doing but stay tuned in this video because it's very entertaining but this trainer is going to do a set of five with all recommended teams if you don't know what recommended team is is are basically when you delete all your parties in the league that you're going in so in this case great league uh niantic will select pokemon for you that are in and around the 1500 cp range and um if you've ever done auto rec battles as we like to call them in the community they are super fun because you end up with all sorts of pokemon but they're a lot of fun because both parties are using recommended teams. In this case, this trainer is the only one using recommended teams versus very meta teams at this rating range. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what teams he draws up and and how how he's going to be able to uh, battle battle through this one. Should be entertaining. Um, going to start off with a uh, Lolan Golem. This is actually a very good matchup. These Volt Switches are doing super effective damage and double resist and actually pretty good situation makes a really nice switch out into grottle hopefully this grottle has razor leaf it does and it's absolutely shredding this this wish cash and this wish cash is going to throw a mud bomb but it's really not going to do that much uh grottle as a pure grass type does resist uh, but it's going to get farmed now so oh oh here comes alolan marowak uh, gonna go for the energy ball. I'm actually really shocked it got to the energy ball given that it is doing razor leaf uh, and actually draws a shield. Well, that's a little bit surprising there. Um, honestly, who knows what Moveset Grottle has. It's kind of a tricky situation. Gonna go into a Lolan Golem. Uh, gonna have to be careful of those bone clubs since they're double super effective and gonna switch out and catch the what I presume is the bone club. That's a really nice play. And then here comes, um, yeah, okay, here comes Skarmory. Uh, gonna look to land. I would actually, sh it's, is it worth shielding? I don't know. It's debatable. Uh, Cause like, to be honest, could, probably could have farmed down the Skarmory, but why not? Close combat while you can, does a lot of damage. And this is a little bit of a tricky, oh, hit him on top. Lower defense, I don't care. I'm still dancing my way to the top stone edge wins game one with an alolan golem hit him on top and razor leaf grottle gg <laughs> okay all right next one okay looks like he he selects a few of them okay all right this is still a weird team crustal um hypno and something else i actually kind of like the other team better so uh this is neutral ish matchup but uh, Wish Cash is, uh, uh, or Wish Cash is doing, oh yeah, selects a Lolan Golem again, wow. Uh, is this going to be a, everything is neutral, so, uh, still does quite a bit, and here comes another X Scissor. It does spam it pretty quickly, these fewer counters. It's about six turns, but uh, it's gonna get outpaced and gonna switch out into Hypno. And it is staying in. Is this gonna be a Blizzard? Oh, it is a Blizzard. Really good shield there. And we're gonna see what's gonna come out next. It is gonna be, oh, okay. Uh, Skarmory in a very good position, has Thunder Punch. And I mean, you switch into this hypno, you have no idea what moves it has. And another pu thunder punch is going to connect and or get shielded. And is it gonna shield or not? Technically, has you know, <laughs> okay, gonna throw this thunder punch, hoping to grab a shield. Let's see if that's gonna be the case. Uh, gonna make the aggressive switch anyways and look to take it out with one volt switch and oh my gosh okay gonna go for the neutral rock blast to be honest wild charge would do probably do more damage because rock blast is an absolutely terrible move um 
Gonna go for another one. Able to get to it really quickly with these Volt Switches. And does shield actually, so probably no shield. And then go into Crustal. And apply a lot of pressure. Oh, gonna go into him now, makes sense too. Uh, gonna be able to land this Fire Punch and this will leave Meganium super low. And then one Confusion is enough to take it out. GG. Okay, let's see uh, what this trainer draws up next. It's going to be... Okay. <laughs> Selects a few. Okay, that's okay. They're still kind of random. I don't know how much this counts now. I didn't realize how much uh, auto select he did. Okay, this is still a very spicy team. Wormadam, Scrafty, and Steelix. And then uh, Wormadam. Oh yeah, this is not a great situation. Um, gonna was trying to catch the Sky Attack. Uh, not able to. Gonna switch out into Steelix after trying to catch the next one. Um, oh, here comes him. Oh, okay. Um, not gonna get KO'd. Let's see what's gonna happen. Power up punch. Is this him on? Okay, gonna go for the nuke. Oh my gosh, it actually doesn't KO. And no shield. I'm not actually not sure what I'm more shocked of. That I didn't KO or that um okay. Not in a re not in a pretty bad situation, I'm not gonna lie. Uh I don't think this is gonna be a win. That skunk tank would have been really handy in the last uh uh yeah, not in a good situation at all. This is probably gonna be um an ice beam, but really what choice? Like Scrafty actually has zero chance of beating a Zoomerol. And going to throw the Iron Head. Really hoping that this uh, Azumarill actually does not shield. And going to switch out into Scrafty. Um, not in a great situation. There's really not nothing that this trainer can do at this point in time. Play Rough connects. Oh my gosh, that absolutely destroyed. Probably not going to shield here. Going to let it go. Niantic did not come through this time around. All right, and we're gonna go into this next battle. Uh, this is a decent team. Okay, first, first, uh, this is a decent team. Uh, Alolan Graveler, um, Sunny Cast Form, and oh my, my word! I don't think that this is possible to win. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it here. I don't think this is. They're all weak to Stunfist. This is absolute, unless it does not shield this Earthquake. That's like the only play. That's like, if this Earthquake gets shielded, this is GG. There's no way. There's no, okay, gonna go for the Rock Slide. Um, hoping to grab a shield. I don't even think it's gonna shield. Oh my gosh, had a chance to. What is happening here? Okay. Um, it's not gonna, I think this thing has, already has energy. Gonna go for the rock slide again. I don't think it's gonna shield. I don't even, okay, it does shield this time. Um, had a chance though, straight up win the game or win this matchup if it landed the earthquake. You know, in a really terrible situation right now, um, I guess Sunny Cash One's gonna be able to survive these mud bombs. They're gonna be able to ember down. Is it going to be able to ember? Oh my gosh, that's super close. Okay. Here comes Skarmory. Oh, is there a Registeel in the back? Okay, going to switch out. And... Oh, oh, okay. Um, oh man, Cast Swarm looking pretty good in this situation. Uh, let's see what's going to happen. Zero shields left. Is this Golem and Golem be able to take out this Meganium? Oh my gosh. A lonely Golem going for the sweep. It double resists these uh the the flying moves, so unless it goes for a flash cannon. Oh my gosh. From 
absolute zero chance of winning to winning with two Pokemon. That was <laughs> that was that was a crazy match. That was a oh my gosh, like that was absolutely nuts. Um Honestly, like if that uh pseudo would have landed the earthquake, um well I guess the Meganium would have came in. Okay. Taking a while to select this new team. Um Honestly, not drawing anything absolutely amazing. Um, okay, okay. Double counter users or double charm users? That's the question. Like, how well do you know the movesets on your Pokemon? I, I, I would have no idea what moveset my Dawn fan had. Okay. Not the worst matchup. Actually, looks like it's decent. This is just a Hydro Cannon, right? Yeah, just a Hydro Cannon. Only three charms came through. And can shield shield once and charm down i think that's probably going to be the play yeah hydro cannon shield once and charm down oh here comes bastidon oh my gosh okay uh scrafty gonna have a field day it's gonna be so boosted after this and it's probably gonna have to take a flamethrower i would just take it scrafty's pretty tanky and bastidon does not hit that hard with flamethrower does almost nothing to uh the scrafty is very healthy uh what are we gonna see come out oh it is a polyrath with oh my gosh wow okay this is very interesting okay shields the power up punch another power punch coming through i expect a dynamic punch from this polyrath to be coming through very shortly and probably gonna no shield this Oh, it's an ice punch and these counters are adding up gonna look to charm down oh the question is how much oh it's a power up punch okay but it has definitely has another charge move let's see what's gonna happen let's it go here comes swampert oh gets deleted by clefable huge win that was a very you know obviously don't do that but that was a very exciting five sets of battles uh some really miraculous comebacks and some really interesting teams so anyways i'm gonna leave it there if you like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see everyone in the next video